Good morning, midday, and midnight to everybody watching this video now or a year from now, whenever you're seeing this. Today we are going to tackle another Pokemon topic. Now, in my last Pokemon video, I did early route um, bird Pokemon, and now I'm going to do early route bug Pokemon, and I'm actually going to cover all of them, not just the fully evolved ones. So when you start playing Pokemon, you know, you, you start with your first Pokemon, your starter, and then you venture out on your adventure, and you'll encounter some Pokemon pretty quickly. Usually a bug Pokemon like one of these is one of the first ones you will see. So today we're going to dive in and tackle some of these. Not all of these are early route ones, but most of them are from pretty early in their respective games. So we're going to go ahead and rank them. Our ranking scale is starting at epic, great, good, average, meh, and why does this exist is our bottom tier. We'll figure out a couple in those. And remember, on my Pokemon rankings, I am not ranking on how good these Pokemon are. I am ranking them based solely on how they look and what I think of them. Let's go ahead and start. We're going to put the entire Caterpie line here in average. It's just average. It, you know, it's, it's the original bug Pokemon, but nothing really to write home about here. Um, I think Weedle is not as good as Caterpie. Um... It's kind of just meh for me. Same thing with Kakuna. Honestly, I think it's more the color than anything. Um, but I do like Beedrill. I, I like Beedrill better than um, Butterfree. So that one's going to end up in good for me. Uh, Lady Ba and Lady In, they're fine. Uh, Spinarat and Ariados. Yeah, they're average. They're fine. Uh, Wurmple is fine. I think we're going to have a lot in average here. They're just bug Pokemon. It's two evolutions. These are actually two different Pokemon. Um, Slickoon and Cascoon. Uh, I like Beautifly and Dustox. They feel like better versions of Butterfree. And I like how they're a little bit different from one another. I think Ninjask is good. I think Nin, uh, Kata and Shedinja are great. I think those are excellent Pokemon. Um, Sheninja actually might be epic just because of his whole... It's one of the most unique Pokemon out there. And the fact that it comes from such a random early game Pokemon is pretty cool. For those of you that don't know, uh, Sheninja only has one HP. And so it can be killed by literally anything. But it has an ability that makes it so that it's immune to anything that would not uh, be super effective against it. So you have to hit it with something like Fire. Um, like a water attack would do nothing to Shininja, even though he only has one HP. It's protected. So, very epic Pokemon. Let's see here. I think Krikatot and Krikatoon are pretty meh. Not a big fan. They're kind of just whatever. Um, I love the different Burmy types. And this is the same Pokemon three times, because it has three different forms. So that's pretty good for me. Motham is whatever. I actually don't think Motham is as cool as three of all forms. Um, Vesquin is great. That's not Vesquin. Of all form of Combi is great, and Combi can go down there in good. Though I don't like how male Combi just doesn't involve. I get it because of the whole B thing, but yeah. Um, this thing's ugly. I hate it. This thing is average. Leveny is actually great. I've been using a Leveny on a playthrough of a Pokemon Black 2, and it's actually like really, really good. Um, I'm not really ranking based on the fact that it's good, but it's just really surprised me in how much I like this Pokemon. This thing's ugly. Seems pretty good. There we go. Uh, yeah. Similar thing here to Swadloon. Oh, I do actually like, I love all the different uh, wings that this one has. Grubbin. Grubbin sucks. But Chargebug and Vikabolt are cool. Now, the only thing for me that keeps Vikabolt from being epic is I feel like it should be a really fast Pokemon. It's not. So it doesn't kind of live up to the fantasy that I feel like it should have. Bombi, not a big fan. This thing is one of the ugliest Pokemon I've ever seen. Orbeal's good. All right. 
I know I didn't have a lot of analysis on that, but the early game bug Pokemon, what do you want me to say? That's going to be my tier list and ranking here. Looks like Shininja was the only one we got up there in epic tier. Such a unique Pokemon, even though it is pretty much a meme most of the time. With a lot of these early starters. A lot of these Pokemon is just like, just started the second one. Like, how is Charge Bug not the first Pokemon in that line? It's just, yeah, why does Grubbin exist? That's my thought on that. Uh, if you guys have any comments, leave them down below. There'll be another ranking uh, tier list tomorrow at noon. Subscribe if you want to see that. This has been the guy that makes random tier lists, signing out.